He's from Long Island, so you know he's funny. It seems today there are more distractions than ever for Is drivers. There are more drivers, of course, and more trucks Fantasy. on the highways and byways. Thank you Getting so much. in your yeah, car can mean you, you have to be you on the defense yeah. every so, mile. Our guest this morning knows firsthand Joshua Acosta with the Peppy Towing Company. is a big equipment tow truck driver himself. He has seen his share of distracted drivers. Peppy, it's good to have you with us. This is not something you want to share. Show up if you're having an I accident. I hope you don't no, use that. If I'm on scene, it's, it's well, bad news. Well, you moved out here about seven How many years of these right? yes, uh, do out you to see Los here? Angeles seven years ago? I had well, a, yeah. You know what? On a good week, right we average about four to five. Well, people big are just wrecks. genuinely funny. Sometimes we're just one, such maybe characters, two. you know? Uh, so what, it varies, but usually the rainy season will bring out a lot. And what do you think is the main cause of distraction for drivers? Whether it's, you know, just to yourself in the automobile or, you know, the big rigs. People were talking loud to me. And I was like, phones. I'm not deaf, uh, I can before, hear you. you know, so back in I was high school, like, oh my, God, do I sound my generation like was known like, as the like, one that they're you know, texting while driving. Now, now, now from my cab, I can see, I mean, it's, it's you everybody. You lose the accent, it's older people, it's moms, time, it's dads, you know, it yeah. checking yeah. emails on YouTube, me, but, but cell phones would be the number one. You hear this thing? Now, are all of your trucks equipped with video with cameras? Like, there's no... But I think people from the East Coast are genuinely Because I know that you sent us some video of actually one driver who was trying to kind of cut your truck off. Yeah, it's all the time. Know, uh, it's just, my truck it's was like over the freeway. Or you have to get over the, the sound of another car. Vito <laughs> right over the table. Force it and yeah. slam on his so brakes and you been doing almost crash. Uh, 13 and, and years. So wow. Do you know yeah. at the time did you, did you whether or not that to do this driver was just when you were changing his well, mind no, or I just, uh, the fact um, that perhaps maybe you know he was distracted. Hard to tell. I think distraction. They're on the phones or breathing or doing whatever. And by the time they look up, they're like, oh, my exit. You know, and then I'm getting in a hurry instead of just going off to the exit. I did it was either and, you know, sadly, you know, most of us oh, have so probably done it one, one time or another. You know, we at the very no, last no, minute, no, we no, realize, no, oh, that's no, my age that I forgot, community. you know, kind of Unless thing. Really, because we're yeah, just not paying attention. It's a sadistic yes, it's correct. And people panic. That, I want you, you to tell us about this particular truck. This is kind of hanging off the end here. But what was the backstory on this? This is our most recent rollover. This happened this past Saturday in the Long Beach area. And it was attached to a 53-foot trailer that was loaded. through he took a corner going general, a little bit too fast um, and it completely on his driver's side the whole thing. Unfortunately, and is it, there part is of like it is, are some of the drivers really not like experienced to drive rigs like, like, like this? Since I was a little kid, you know, I Relatively used to do speaking, pulling yes, or anything like that. It's not that hard to get a, a commercial laugh. license. Okay. So I used to say if so, I can make them laugh, you know, companies want to save money by hiring any driver, I think. So it takes a lot more experience to drive one of these on a regular car. So, you know, interestingly, you said on a good week, which I know you didn't mean in the sense of, wow, we've got more business. Because I tell you, idiot. when, when a trip like this shows up, I mean, I was, in ADHD, many cases, still, you know, so um, someone's like, ah, life has been taken. You know, like, it wasn't uh, was at We the do board, see those, but, unfortunately, that is part of the along. job. And those are usually probably the toughest ones, especially because a lot of times it can be avoided. Well, I, I say if, you know, just by not speeding, by paying attention, by just, you know, hands 10 and 2, the way they teach you at the DMV. Yeah, put the phone down. Yeah, yeah, especially if you're in a big truck, you know, you don't, you can't be going 70 miles an hour like these cars, and you see that, you see it, I'm sure, these guys flying. Yeah, well, Joshua, I appreciate you being here today and bringing this out. This is a really powerful reminder of, of paying attention, because we don't want to see you. <laughs> no I hope not no to see, I hope not to see you as well. <laughs> All right, great. Thank you. No All right, problem. we'll take a break. We'll be right back.